What's going on guys? In this video, I just like restarted this video like five times. We're gonna power through it. Here it is. In this video, I wanna to talk to you guys about film swapping. What film swapping is and why it's most possibly or probably some of the most fun that you can have shooting a role with somebody else. So you have a nice shot of the inside of my camera bag because I accidentally took a shot when I took it out of my camera bag. Sorry. We don't make mistakes. We have happy accidents. Basically, you'll have two people and person A will shoot a roll of film in its entirety and then they'll rewind the roll, leaving a little bit of the leader out, and then they'll send that roll to somebody else. The second person will then take that same roll that's already been shot, pop it in their camera, and shoot it again. And this is just like multiple exposing the same roll, um, but you're doing it with two people, and most likely two different locations. Now, there aren't really any rules for film swapping. There are a few things that might be kind of helpful, though, if the first person w were to mark out the, the shutter window, like where is the shutter? And then this way the, the second person knows kind of how to line that up or, or where to line that up when they pop the roll into their camera and then your frames will be somewhat similar. And to try to keep this, the exposure somewhat even and balanced, um, you, you probably want to reduce your exposure when you're shooting. Um, it kind of helps blend everything a little bit better. Now I just finished up a, a recent film swap with the world famous Lou of Sweet Lou Photography. There's a couple reasons why I, I like Lou. He's not, not pretentious. pretentious. And uh, he takes pictures of turds. Fantastic. But on a serious note, Lou's like a super friendly guy and we both share like a big passion for music. Now he's got a series on his channel called Double Vision where he'll go and film swap with other photographers and he's actually done videos with uh, two of my favorite YouTubers, Esrad and the old camera guy. For our swap, he shot and sent me a roll of um, Lomo Metropolis, and uh, I think I sent him a roll of Ector 200. Now, the only Lomo films that I shot before this were Lomo Purple. I mean, everybody shot Lomo Purple, you know, um, and, and some Lady Grey. So I was kind of excited to, to check this out and see what it looked like. This, just like a, a lot of other Lomo films, are like a multi-rated ISO, uh, which means that you can just shoot it at different ISOs and kind of get different results. Like the, the film look will change depending on what ISO you use. Uh, we both shot it at 400 uh, and it was just developed normally uh, being a C41 film. I would be curious to shoot this in like a non-multiple exposure scenario, you know, just to see how like uh, a straight photo would, would look. So uh, it's definitely something that I would shoot again. All right. So to close out, I want to ask you guys to go check out Lou's channel. Um, his videos are amazing. They're super entertaining and the edits are super fast and all over the place. I mean, I have the attention span of a gnat. So if they could keep me hooked, that says something, you know. I'll put all, links to, you know, all Lou's stuff, the, the socials and channel and stuff like that. That'll be in the description. Um, Lou, thanks again for swapping, man. Um, hope everybody's well. And until the next video, we'll see you. Lou took a picture of a rock, and these pictures had like a love child.